the members of Tau Beta Sigma that you see, they're evident. You know who they are. What it really came down to was the people. I saw a sense of purpose. A lot of the band leadership was in Tau Beta Sigma. They were wearing the letters. I saw some ladies that were in the band who were like really helping out with the band, helping serve. They were always the first ones there and the last ones to leave. They were the ones who uh, gave out uniforms and went above and beyond with service events. I really connected to that. Just felt that connection. So I thought, why not join a band sorority? I felt like I was home. Tau Beta Sigma came into being because of the role of women back in the late 30s and 40s was very sparse. Women were not in the band. The Alpha Omicron chapter of Cap Kappa Psi was just founded at Texas Tech and was doing wonderful things for their band program. One woman, her name was Wayva Baines, a young woman who joined the band program at that time. She wanted to be a part of that and she petitioned to join them and they said no women are not allowed in this group. And I thought, you know, they won't let us in, naturally. And so it's, I think, you know, we should have something of our own. So she grabbed the other two women that were in the band and said. So the three of us decided we would have our own sorority, band sorority. And so that's what she did. That's the way it all began. In Tau Beta Sigma in general, when it comes to the band directors, we're there to make it happen. It's actually a great honor that the band director trusts us to take on these responsibilities to be able to serve our band program. We're constantly looking for our members to be the best band members they can be. So when I see a famous marching band on TV and I know we have chapters there, I, I take some pride in saying we help make them successful. Just having that big group of people that come together to meet a common goal, and our common goal is to serve the band. The spirit that we have and the contagiousness of it that just it spreads throughout the band. Tabita Sigma to me really means family. I had always wanted a sister and then I got hundreds. I got thousands even. It's just how I think a family works. You get together, you're not all the same, but you make it work. The fact that the organization embraces, celebrates, and nurtures diversity. And I think that's another thing about Tabita Sigma and band in general, how it can transcend our differences. I think music kind of brings people together and it brings people from different places, from different backgrounds to build relationships and friendships all because of band and because of music. Top of the Sigma, especially when it comes to like the leadership roles I have held, has taught me so much about professionalism, working with other people, but also still remembering what you're passionate about. Top of the Sigma provides you with that structural thinking and that creative thinking to see a problem and think of 12 different ways to fix it. It makes me a lot more confident. Being confident in the things I learned in Top of the Sigma gives me the confidence to take on and be anything else that I want to be in life. On this day, I shall profess. I will be taking basically everything that I've learned in TBS with me. The people I have met in Top Beta Sigma are still my friends to this day. I'm going to be able to find a friend in that person no matter what walk of life they're in, or what chapter they're from, or what school they're from, what their major is. You'll be able to call somebody 10 years later in life that has a different skill set than you, and say, hey, I need your help with something, and they'll be there for you. I can never give back to Tall Beta Sigma what they have given to me. And I cannot imagine my life without Tall Beta Sigma. Sisterhood, like it's a lifetime connection. So from today, until my rest with my sisters